22 لمدرسة الياسات الخاصة اسمي ميتا سعيد الحفيتي من الصف الهادي عشر وسأكون مقدمة الحفل لكم هذا المساء We are gathered here today to celebrate our seniors as they step in front of our graduates. Without further ado, let us welcome into the auditorium the graduating class of 2022. بداية مع النشيد الوطني الإماراتي Dr. Asif Badir, our school's executive principal. 
who would like to share a speech dedicated to our seniors. والآن مع كلمة المدير التنفيذي من مدرستنا الدكتور عاصف فليتفضل. Dear honored guests, family members, parents, and the graduating class of 2022, it is my honor to be here to speak a few words in front of you. Today, I welcome you to the graduation ceremony for the class of 2022. I could say many things about the accomplishments of our students. Throughout these years, they've worked dedicated and long hours to achieve the things that they have done. However, I think it's best to see their success through their own eyes. So today, the representatives have prepared some small presentations for you. Because the best way to see our children shine is through their voices and through their work. To the graduating class of 2022, I leave you with one message and one thing to reflect on as you move forward. In the traditions of the Arabs, there is an off-sighted tradition. In the Allah Jamil, or Yuhibbul Jamal, that God is beautiful and He loves beauty. So strive to be the most beautiful people that you can be. Life will be difficult at times. But the true beautiful people are the ones who can smile through it all, who are able to help their friends in times of difficulties, who are able to support their parents as they grow older, who care about their nation and work to make it a better place to, to live. You are the stars in this particular country, and you will be the stars that will reflect the light in this world. So just be beautiful. As long as you are true to your beauty, you will always be the best people in this world. And I leave by asking for all of you the best of success. Work your hardest, but always remember, all of your success is ultimately from God. And I thank you all for coming, and I will allow our students to really take time to share their thoughts with you. Thank you very much. Let's see if you can get this next to them. To all people graduate in what way? They graduate top of their class. Well, our next speaker is Daphne Tito, and is one of the top students in this year's graduating class. I would like to welcome to the stage this year's silent tutorial, Khalid Hussein Hadamar. We will share with you. <laughs> بأي طريقة يتخرج طلاب طويلي القامة؟ يتخرجون على رأس فئتهم. المتحدث التالي هو طويل القامة وهو أحد أفضل الطلاب في صفه. الآن مع كلمة الطالب خالد حسين الحضرمي. Friends and family members, teachers, Mr. Lamon, Mrs. Zreen, Dr. Asif. Mrs. Johanna, Mr. Sultan, and class of 2022. Good evening. Welcome to the day where a chapter ends and a new one begins. Welcome to the day when we open a new page, a page that has yet to be filled with new life experiences that we will soon be embarking on. I am proud and honored to be named the Salutatorian of al Private Schools graduating class of 2022. Not gonna lie, I didn't even know what the sanitarium was. <laughs> until, I, until I realized that I was a few DPA points off from being a valedictorian. But hey, we all know second place is not bad at all. <laughs> being at a USF private school has been a roller coaster ride for me. The thing about roller coaster rides is that they have their ups and their downs. Yet, they are exciting and unforgettable. Ever since I joined the school, my life has flipped 180 degrees, both academically and personally. I have learned so much in just three years. I have met some wonderful people, gained wonderful experiences, and I even survived a pandemic. <laughs> Do you all remember when COVID-19 came along and turned our lives upside down? How could we forget? We missed our IMG trip that week. <laughs> our whole lives were thrown into misery, but we still stood strong with our heads held high, ready to take on every challenge that came our way. 
I would like to take this opportunity to, take, to address my classmates directly. Class of 2022, congratulations to all of you for persevering through the challenges, overcoming the obstacles, and completing all the endless assignments that were part and parcel of our senior year. Thank you all for the beautiful, sad, happy, funny, and crazy memories from completing quizzes, exams, map tests, pranking the stream with Salah's head, <laughs> to preparing for PSATs, MSATs, and ILECs to determine our next step. We went through all of this together. We've all worked tirelessly, knowing that one day it would be worth it. Well, my friends, guess what? That day has finally come. Take a look around. You sit in a room full of future doctors, engineers, soldiers, astronauts, businessmen and women, and leaders. Today is a stepping stone towards the rest of our lives. I am so grateful that I get to share it with all of you. This might possibly be the last day where we will all be seated together in one, in one place. So let's sum it all in and embrace the wonderful evening ahead of us. I would also like to take this opportunity to give a special thanks to our parents. Thank you so much for providing us for, for providing us all of the support you have given us throughout all of our, our years. Good news is, your job is done now. From this day forward, we are going to be responsible for the rest of our lives. It is time for you, as Mr. Lamont says, relax. <laughs> I wish I have made you proud throughout our years. Just as you expected. Thank you so much for everything. Finally, finally, yes, finally I stopped talking. My father has always told me that as graduating students, we are like little chicks that are about to start cracking through the egg of life. Meaning that as graduates, although it may feel like it now, this is not the end. In fact, it is only the beginning. <coughs> Our job now is to burst through this egg and continue growing and exploring this egg-sighting adventure. <laughs> With that said, ladies and gentlemen, and the senior class of 2022, I formally welcome you to our to Aliasad our Private School's 2022 graduation ceremony. Thank you. The next guest is a woman of many athletes. She is very well known across the health sector, and we have often seen her provide us daily with updates during the pandemic and the COVID situation across the UAE. Aside from being the official spokesperson of the health sector and the executive director of Communicate with Diseases, she also happens to be a mother celebrating the graduation of her son this evening. We welcome to the stage Her Excellency, Dr. Farida al Hussein. <laughs> حاصلة على العديد من الجوائز إنها معروفة جدا في القطاع الصحي قد رأيناها تزودنا يوميا خلال الوباء بتحديثات عن حالة كوفيد-19 في جميع أنحاء الإمارات إلى جانب كونها المتحدث الرسمي عن القطاع الصحي في دولة الإمارات والمدير التنفيذي للأمراض المعدية فيصادف اليوم أيضا بأنها أم تحتفل بتخرج ابنها لنرحب على المسرح بسعادة الدكتورة فريدة It gives me a great pleasure to welcome graduates, families, teachers, and administrators. Today is a great day of celebration. We are gathering to celebrate the success of our children. And we cannot be more proud. On my behalf, and on behalf of the families and parents, I congratulate you on this achievement. Time passed quickly, and you will always remember the most difficult times and the most difficult challenges, and also the heartfelt joys that we went through during all the years past. And here you are today, at the end of your school journey. We are proud of you and your accomplishments. Hard work pays off, and today you proved it. 
Dear graduates, I will not talk to you about COVID-19 today. <laughs> I will share with you my story. I was born in a small village in the countryside far from Abu Dhabi with very limited facilities and services. So you are luckier than me being in this school. We had a wonderful beach and marvelous deserts around us and I went to school in this small society. In the difficult days, I remember singing on my way to school. وَمَسِيرِي نَحْوَ دَرْسِي خَيْرُ مَا يُسَيْدُ نَفْسِي إِنَّنِي نَبْتَتُ رَوْضًا وَهُوَ مَا إِيْ شَمْسِي And to translate this, the road that takes me to school brings joys and happiness. I'm like a plant in the garden, and the school is my water and sunshine. Indeed, school helped me to grow and be the person I am today. I remember the day I graduated and I was not sure what path I would take and how the end of the road looks like. But I was confident that I can pass the difficult days and succeed. Medicine was my third choice. However, I didn't see myself working in hospital. So I followed my intuition. And I worked in a place that I enjoyed every single day. A place that can impact people's life positively and make them healthier every day. I chose a place that can influence the society positively and help me to be myself. High school is unforgettable journey that prepares you to the future. I'm sure that these past years have involved some of the most memorable and influential moments of your lives. Each one of you is unique. Remember that. I hope that you are filled with excitement and anticipation as the next stage of your life is about to begin. You have the freedom to define who you are, find your passion, and remember you will fail, but don't give up. Life is hard work and there is no easy way out. Be responsible, respect this world, and believe in yourself. You can make the difference in the world. I would like to take this opportunity to extend our sincere thanks to the teachers and school administrators who are behind this achievement. A world without educators is a world that doesn't exist. You have been an important source of knowledge and experience that guided our children through their work. And this knowledge and experience will enable them in the next stage of their lives and in the years to come. I would like to end my speech with a quote from Steve Jobs. The only way to do great work is to love what you do. Thank you. This evening, we not only celebrate the success of our graduates, but also the success and journey of Alias South Private School since its inception, tracing back to 1992. This group marks the second ever grade 12 graduating class and one of our most talented cohorts. Speaking of talent, let's welcome to the stage Ahmed Nada and Musawi of grade 6 who will be performing a musical piece on the piano. بنجاح طلابنا فحسب إنما نحتفل أيضا بنجاح مدرسة الياسات الخاصة ورحلتها منذ بدايتها عام 1992 تمثل هذه المجموعة ثاني دفع التخرج على الإطلاق للصف الثاني عشر وتشكل أكثر المجموعات موهبة وبالحديث عن الموهبة لنرحب جميعا بالطالب أحمد نادر من الصف السادس الذي سيرجف لنا مقطوعة موسيقية على الإطلاق
I would like to thank the faculty and staff at AYPS who allowed me to make this speech today. I, today, I wanted to relay something important that I learned during my time at Elia South Private School. The most profound lesson that I have learned during my high school experience is that one should never sacrifice important relationships just to achieve a goal. Think about any achievement you have accomplished. Most of you will agree that it wasn't reaching your goal that was important, it was the journey you took while doing so. Without the systems we had in place, or the people who helped us along the way, we never would have achieved that goal. We cannot take our achievements to, our, to accomplish our next goal, but we can take the lessons we learned, the habits we formed, and those who supported us along on to our next adventure. Let me put this into perspective. Those who know me will know that I have, I have always been an, individual, a, an ambitious individual. I'm an A student. I'm president of the student council. I'm captain of the football team. And I am a self-proclaimed outstanding citizen. <laughs> In term one of 10th grade, I was presented with my report, report card. At this time, I had purposely isolated myself because I saw everyone and everything else as a distraction for my success. On that day, I opened my report card and there it was, everything I had worked for. At first, I was elated. I had done it. Go me. But then, the tunnel vision had faded. I looked around the room, full of my classmates, congratulating and consoling each other, and suddenly felt very alone. It was at this point that I realized that I needed to make a change. So I started failing all of my exams on purpose. Kidding, of course I didn't. Uh, jokes aside, this was the moment when I knew I needed to establish a balance between school and life. I made time for my friends, family, and my interests. And I started to become more of the person I am today. And believe me, I'm not saying that you shouldn't achieve anything in life, but make sure you don't become blind to what is truly important. If you can balance both your relationships with the important people in your life, along with the important goals in your life, you win in life. I firmly believe that a lesson learned should be a lesson shared. I hope you carry this lesson everywhere you go to ensure you don't make the same mistakes that I did. I would like to end this speech the way I conclude all of my school emails. For the last time, this is your favorite student, Maryam Jamal. And thank you so much. A huge part of our grade 12 student success has been through the unwavering support of the school staff who have played a pivotal role in each of our lives as students. Two of our graduates, Moses Aydin Mahnadi and Al Maha Ali Mazrohi, took it upon themselves to capture social messages from the staff across the school. Let's have a look. Today is a very special day for all of you. It's the day where you start a new part of your journey. Over the last four years, I've got to see you grow, to smile, to laugh, and sometimes you even cry. I want to remind you of the most important lesson I think all of you should remember. Life is short. These four years have went really quickly for you in high school. In just a moment, you'll realize that you've gotten older and older. So as you live your life, live it with purpose and live it with meaning. As you tread your steps every single day, remember to do good to the people around you. Remember to honor your family, to honor your country, and to honor the community that you're around. You are all wonderful, amazing individuals, and I wish you all the best in this world and the next. For me, as your principal, it has been an honor. I look forward to seeing you grow up and come back to visit the school with your own children and your own families. 
with all the love in my heart, I wish you the best, I wish you the families the best, and I look forward to seeing you. So I know you guys may be a bit upset that you guys are bidding farewell to students, uh, staff, and even some of the walls in the school. However, one thing that will never leave are the lasting memories that you've imprinted on every single place here at Aliasab Private School. I wish you the best of luck, don't be strangers, and I know the future is bright as you guys step right into it. Good luck. Hey grads, uh, this is such an exciting time for you guys. Um, it's been so great to have you guys in the school for all these years and I just want to say a huge congratulations to you guys. And um, I will say that your cohort is very well known for its excellence. So what a wonderful time. Congratulations again and uh, we wish you all the best on your future endeavors. Thank you. Congratulations seniors, you've done it. You demonstrated how your hard work and determination can get you to the next phase of your life. Remember, you are powerful and I want you to use your powers for good. You have done it and you can do it again. Hello my amazing grade 12 student. I must say it has been a pleasure teaching you. I will truly miss each and every one of you. You've made um, the classroom experience so much better and I would like to wish you all the best in the future. I wish you many, 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 many successes. I'd like you to remember that you should always make yourselves proud first, then make your family proud, make the school proud, and make me proud. I will miss you and enjoy what life has to offer. Just go and do your best and um, keep in touch. Take care, everybody. Congratulations to all of you, the graduates of 2022. We shared a lovely and memorable journey, and you'll be missed. New challenges, new successes are waiting for you. But remember, the failure is only when you quit and when you lose hope. All I can say is stay positive, put 100% effort in everything that you do, and leave rest to Allah. God bless you and good luck. Graduating class of 2022, congratulations on this very special time in your lives. Although I never had the pleasure of having you as my own students, your energy, vitality and spirit will be greatly missed around the school once you leave. And I wish you all the best for your future endeavors. Hello, good afternoon everyone. So we are, uh, I am nurse Amira and this is my colleague uh, nurse uh, Priya. So we would uh, like to uh, congratulate all of our graduate students on their graduation. And we are wishing you all success in your future. So all the very best and we will miss you a lot and we love you. Thank you so much. Hello my lovely grade 12 students. Time flies so fast. I can't believe it's just to say goodbye. Uh, we had a wonderful time during the online even uh, physical learning. You guys were amazing. Uh, I wish you all the very best for the future. I wish that you will make your teacher, family and the country. Congratulations on becoming a graduate, my wonderful and amazing students. You have always been the senior anyone would expect. You are special because I saw you growing up and becoming young ladies and gentlemen. The feeling is incredible that I have been your teacher for the last six years in the school. I wish you many more accomplishments in your life. Graduation is not the end, but it's the beginning of many more success stories that you are going to write with your efforts. Always remember our theme, learners today, leaders tomorrow. I want to say for the Eco Club members and sustainability ambassadors, you are amazing and you did a great job over the last six years. Special thanks to the amazing parents and congratulations on the graduation of your son or daughter. Seniors 2022, I'm so proud of you. I love you all and I will miss you so much. Wishing you happy graduation. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Ustaz Tabit Abidat, Murshid al Marhal al-Thanawiyya. بتمنى لطلابنا خريجي الصف 2022 مستقبل مشرق مزهر وكانت السنة حافلة بالإنجازات وأتمنى أن يكون كل طالب حصل على التخصص الذي الذي يريده وأتمنى أن يكونوا بيتم الصحة والعافية ونراكم إن شاء الله في كل في مجال عمله شكرا جزيلا. It has been an absolute pleasure to be dealing with the Aliasat graduating seniors of 2022. Gentlemen and ladies, you are some of the brightest minds that I have ever dealt with. You are respectful, you are respective, and 
I can imagine you guys were the people they were talking about when they said, you can be the greatest, you can be the best. Make us proud, guys. Take care. Congratulations, grade 12. You've done it. You have made it to the end. Uh, this is a very important uh, step in your journey as you leave high school. I want you to be encouraged. I want you to be empowered. Uh, as you go out into the world, as you face the many challenges, rest assured that Ali Asad has armed you with the necessary tools to take on life, to take on the world. And I'm very sure that you will excel in all that you do. Hi guys, you guys were like the freshmen when I started at Ali Asad, so there. So we grew up together. I can't believe how far you guys have come. My message to you guys is life outside there is hard. Take it, each challenge as it comes, take it day by day. Know that you have the correct tools and you know and believe in yourself that you can do it and then you'll be make a great success. We are so proud of you and all the amazing projects and advancements you have done while you've been at this school. My hope for you is that as you go through life, you pursue every single dream that you um, imagine. The world is actually your oyster and you're the ones that are gonna change the world. Oh, we can't wait to see what you're going to do. We love you and we hope you come back and visit because although this is a great time, it's really sad because we're going to already miss your faces. Have a great life, seniors, and we're so proud of you. Woo! Hi, congratulations. Uh, my lovely seniors, Alessa's uh, private school student. So I am really sad you are leaving because I, I wish you all the best and congratulations in future. Uh, so you uh, miss, miss me a lot. I, am, I love you so much. Very excellent, grateful student. I am really love you. Bye. Hey, how are you doing? You grade 12s, I am happy that I had to meet, I got to meet you. I didn't get a chance to teach you, but I met every single one of you and you're all amazing. Go out there and make a change in the world because I know you guys are brilliant, you're smart, and I know you're going to make an amazing change. Keep up the good work and stay home. Hey seniors, uh, my favorite uh, group in the school, my favorite class, and um, it's been a, a good six years that I started teaching you. Um, I will look back in fond memories with all the, you know, over the past six years, and I wish you all the best of luck for next year now that you're finished and, um, and I'll remember things like the French trip for the students that went with on that um, I remember the students that refused to write anything grade 7 when I started to teach you uh, and now writing five body paragraph essays the students that didn't say anything in class that was dead quiet and now can't stop talking in class which is a good thing um, you know, and there's, there's a lot of good things, the trips we had to, I think it was Warner Brothers. Um, you, know, you know, we had a, a, you know, quite a few field trips and things, so, you know, there's a, a lot of good memories to remember. I have been involved in your training for 4 years ago, and I have been involved in you, and I have been involved in your training, and I have been involved in your training, and I have been involved in your training. And I ask Allah to أن يدخل إلى قلوبكم السعادة والفرح ويوفقكم ويسدد خطاكم وحياة مليئة بالإنجازات والنجاح في المستقبل أتمنى لكم مزيدا من التوفيق في أيامكم القادمة وتذكروا دائما أن الاجتهاد هو طريق الحياة الجميلة وأوصيكم دائما في العلم فهو الطريق الذي يوصلكم إلى الجنة مبارك عليكم التخرج Hi grade 12, uh, I hope you remember the fun memories that we have from our lessons. Uh, we are in the pool here and I will, I will cherish all the memories, especially with the students from the swimming uh, team. Uh, I hope you have and remember all the fun and cool moments from the football teams, football practices, our games and obviously all our fun and interesting PE lessons. I will miss you a lot, uh, I will miss you around the school and not seeing you in my classes and I hope uh, when we see each other we'll be all smiles. Hi grade 12 girls, congratulations and have a great future. I like you girls and we will miss you and we were, we were, we used to see you every day 
and of course we will meet you i appreciate you thank you thank you very much dear seniors it is a very proud moment for us at adya sat to say goodbye to you and see you graduate this year i want to wish you all the very best and please remember that always the sky is the limit for you take care all the very best best wishes as السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته طلاب وطالبات الصف الثاني عشر درستكم وأنتم في الصف الثامن مرت السنون سريعا الآن وأنتم على أعتاب مرحلة جديدة من حياتكم العلمية والعملية أتمنى لكم كل خير وكل توفيق سعدنا كانت هناك لحظات سعادة وفرح ومرح مرت علينا سنتان من زمن الوباء في كورونا واجتزنا هذه المرحلة سريعا وها أنتم الآن على أعتاب التخرج أنا متأكد مئة بالمئة سيكون وستكون منكم ومن كنا الوزير والسفير والعالم والأديب والطبيب والمهندس هذا شرف لي أن كل عام يتخرج أجيال نسعد بهم نرى فيهم تطورا في مستواهم وأنتم كنتم مثالا للأدب والتربية والعلم فأتمنى لكم من أعماق قلبي المزيد من التقدم والمزيد من الرفعة في مستقبلكم العلمي والحياتي شكرا لكم وفقكم الله ورعاكم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم طلاب وطالبات الصف الثاني عشر مرت السنوات سريعا درستم اجتهدتم وها قد حان وقت تخرجكم مبارك عليكم التخرج ونأمل أن نراكم في المستقبل القريب بإذن الله قادة لمجتمع دولة الإمارات العربية المتحدة مرة أخرى مبارك عليكم التخرج ونسأل الله أن يوفقكم في الدنيا والآخرة Hi students, I'm so excited to know that you're all graduating. You have been awesome, you worked hard, and guess what? It's time for you to just enjoy the world, enjoy college, enjoy the military, and I hope to see you one day in the future. Have an awesome time, guys. Bye. Hi girls, set your goals high and always dream big because you are so big as you are like when you dream high. Happy farewell and wish you all good luck. Congratulations, grade 12s, on your graduation. I remember when I first came to Al Yasat and you were my first group of students in the school. We have had so many memories since then and every time I think about you as a group of students, I am extremely proud. You're not only my students, most of you are my friends and I care so much about you and your potential and your future. I really wish you all the best and I know that you're going to do such great things. Felicitaciones diplomé, congratulations. We are so proud of all your achievements. Wishing you all the best for the future, every success, every happiness. We're so excited to see where you go. We're going to miss you so much. Merci, au revoir. Hey you guys, tonight you guys are official high school graduates. You guys have endured so much over the last two years and you're finally here at the finish line. I want to wish you nothing but great success in whatever you choose to do. Have fun. Congratulations seniors, you're all free from Alisar Private School. I know you might be happy but we're really sad that you guys are going to be leaving us. You are an amazing class. I think the, the grade 11s are going to have some big boots to fill. But I have no doubt that you guys are going to go on and do extremely exciting things and be extremely successful. We have so many students here who are bound for wonderful experiences. Musa is going to be very famous in her field. We've got the likes of Hanin, who's definitely going to become some form of a world leader. Selma, who's definitely going to penetrate the UN. Khaled, who's probably going to be alongside Selma in the future. You've got the likes of Abdullah uh, and Razuki, who's got a bright future ahead of him and anything that he might put his hand to. There's so many of you that I'm so proud of. And I have a small message. Don't forget your English teacher when you're famous and successful. Miss Trina had so much to do with your success. And so please, please uh, enjoy every minute of your graduation. Enjoy every second of the future, the bright future that you have ahead of you. And don't forget us here in Ali Asad. Please come and visit whenever you can. Masalama and congratulations! Woo!
said, Hur Hassan al Hussein, who will recite a special poem with a special evening. الآن نرحب على المسرح حور حسن الحوسني الذي ستلقي قصيدة خاصة في هذه الأنشاء الكلمات تشفع ذلها ولكن ليس من المقام أن يقال شيء على إثرها ونحن اليوم على منصة الحلم نناظرها كمظلة شتوية ارتمينا تحتها حين هام الديم ودوى برعدها وأنارت الفضاء بلهيب برقها لتبث الطمأنين على غير عادتها وتبلغنا بأن الكون ترنم ليزهو بها خريجي اليوم نقف هنا وقد طوينا سنين العطاء ونثرنا عطرها أحار أصيب الحروف بفرحة أم أدم أدع الدموع تنهمل فرميت الشعر قافية ورحت أخذه نثرا لأجمع كل أذيال الحكاية ولا أنسى بها أمرا حكاية طفلة صرخت قبيل العمر منذ زمن كأحجيا بلا حل خطت أول خطواتها تجر وراءها دمية بأسماء تسميها وتطعمها كأن العمر يطويها وتقول لأمها مهلا فهذه طفلتي ولا تلقي بها أرضا فتضحك أمها فرحا وتأخذها إلى الحضن لتنهض بعد أعوام كأنها حلم مضت هما مضت مرضا مضت أملا واليوم نحن كالطفلة مضى عقد وأعوام ترافقه تخط حكاية الطفلة بأحضان القصيد ترنمت وتنعمت وترعرعت واستيقظت هنا اليوم خريجة تجار كل دندنة بألحان لحياة غزلت تناشد كل أغنية بأرقام الدروس تنهدت تجابه كم من من الآمال واستسقت الأحلام وتشكر كل من زرعت في درسها في صفها في صرحها قد أينعت وقد سارت النهج القويم وأزهرت عطافها اليوم قد حان أيا حضورنا الأعزاء ألقوا العنان فما لرجائنا منكم غير الدعاء بأن يكون ما فات من مسيرتنا ابتداء ولنحظى لعمرنا خير انتهاء وابتحاذنا اليوم لرب السماء بأن يكون اليوم مداد من هاج العطاء سلامتكم Our next speaker is a very decorated student of Adi Asad a model student in her entirety who has come out at the very top of the graduating class achieving the highest GPA and having taken part in one of many external competitions. She has worked tirelessly over her high school years to establish herself as an all-around student. I welcome to the stage our 2022 valedictorian, Selma Saleh Shamla. المتحدثة التالية هي طالبة نموذجية ومتميزة نالت أعلى معدل تراكمي كما أنها شاركت وفازت بالعديد من المسابقات الخارجية خلال سنوات دراستها عملت بلا كلل لتثبت نفسها ولتحقق النجاح والتفوق رحبوا معي بالطالبة المتفوقة سالمة صالح شمال Executive Principal Dr. Asif, the Vice Principal Mrs. Reem, parents, teachers, and fellow seniors. We are gathered here today to honor all of the hard work that has gone into the past 12 years and to reflect on our exciting journey. I am deeply honored and grateful to be standing here in front of all of you as the Eliasad Private School Class of 2022 Valedictorian. Alhamdulillah, hearing that this title has been bestowed upon me has made me speechless and truly humbled. I can say that all my hard work throughout my high school years was worth it. I want to express my sincere appreciation to all my teachers, family, parents, and classmates for their unwavering support 
during this journey. They played an essential role and had a vital impact on my success throughout all my academic years. My fellow graduates, I am proud to say that our mission and journey has come to a conclusion today. I am proud of all of you. We have risen to the challenge of this wonderful and sometimes difficult year. High school in Ali Asad private school has taught us different and valuable lessons. Commitment to education, tolerance for others, resilience in the most trying of situations, and so much more. We had days where we cried. We stressed about grades, especially in sad sports. But also, we laughed. We spent time with each other and our teachers. And we always stood by each other when we needed to. All of those moments will be remembered and deeply cherished by each one of us. The opportunities we have gained in Ali Asad Private School has allowed us to forge our own distinct path. We will always remember all the incredible people that we have met and forged strong bonds with as we learn to grow together. When I first stepped into the school, I quickly noticed that we all had different personalities and talents. But what impressed me the most was that we learned how to work together effectively. Now, I cannot say everything went perfectly over these years, and especially not this year. There were some tough days and unique challenges that only graduating students of the last two years know. But, as you can see, they're all behind us now. And they have made us stronger and more well-rounded individuals. It was only a matter of time before we reached this point. And their time as a class would unfortunately end. But I am delighted I can say we have made this journey together. Today, we have officially graduated and our future dreams and goals can now finally become a reality. Yes, we have ended the chapter, but there is another chapter of life awaiting. We do not know what life has waiting for us all. It is a mystery we can't wait to solve. But inshallah, we will have a bright future, achieve our goals, and serve this country into the future with the knowledge and skills we have acquired through the years. Not a single one of us here today has done it alone. There were always people behind us who gave us the strong roots we needed to learn as well as the wings we desired to dream big. I would like to invite my fellow seniors to offer a huge round of applause to families and teachers to show our sincere appreciation of them and their endless effort. I would like to thank my parents, and of course, all the parents tonight for their endless support. To our mothers, thank you for all the sacrifices you have made and putting our needs before your own. To our fathers, thank you for being our heroes, the anchors of strength and stability in our families. We appreciate everything you have done to help us reach the stage in our life. To my fellow seniors, always remember, you are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, and smarter than you think. And as a side joke, as Mr. Norman says, don't forget to carry your kidneys with you. <laughs> I would like to say to you wholeheartedly, 
Today, you leave Elia Saad Private School, stepping into your future, ready to fulfill your potential. I wish you all the best in all your endeavors. Congratulations, class of 2022. We finally did it. Thank you. Now, the moment we have all been waiting for, the procession of our graduates will be coming up on stage to receive their diplomas. We welcome on stage our executive principal, Dr. Asif, and our high school vice principal, Ms. Lee. And now, the moment we have all been waiting for, the moment we have 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 been waiting for, the moment السيدة ريم الصعود على المسرح لتوزيع الشهادة. Before we all go off and celebrate this milestone, we leave you with the closing remarks as will be shared by our fellow graduate, Hanin Fathallah. Your tassels are now placed on the right once we place them to the left 
that is your first step of your journey to the community. Some of you are off to another set of education, while some may start in the chapter of their lives. Wherever you may go and whatever you may do, you will succeed as long as you're doing something you love. We should all be proud of our many accomplishments and take this opportunity to share these achievements with the ones around us as well. Congratulations once again. I wish you all the best of luck as you step into the future. Dear guests, parents, and graduating class of 2022, today you've had an opportunity to listen to their voices and hear their thoughts as they explain what is in their hearts. Today, you've had a chance to experience the talent that is at their fingertips, and you've had a chance to listen to their hearts speak through poetry. And today, you will also witness them become the graduating class of 2022. Graduates, please stand. It is my honor on behalf of the board, having completed all the requirements of high school, you are out all now, the graduating class of 2022. You may turn your tassels. <laughs> 